Hi, hello, good morning. It is November 2nd and I am in such a holiday mood right now. I am feeling so many things. Feeling very thankful already, so many weeks ahead of Thanksgiving, but also feeling very just content and happy and creative and just like everything's gonna work out and be okay and just very like optimistic which is rare <laughs> so i'm gonna lean into this for today today is gonna be a little bit crazy there's so much going on um and i still want to get a little bit of writing done despite the chaos yesterday my friends came over and we made like costumes um it is not Halloween anymore, but we are gonna go watch the Eras Tour movie tonight, which I know it's kind of late. It's been out for like a million years already, but we decided to go with like the You Belong With Me t-shirt, the Junior Jewels, and we're also gonna be making friendship bracelets, which I'm super excited for, but that is later today. So right now it is 11.45. I have class at 12.55 and so I will leave around 12.30ish. And normally I would start with writing. That is the new routine that I've established. But since I have so much work due tomorrow night and tonight, I think I'm just gonna start with like my actual schoolwork and then get to writing later on. So I'm gonna go get some breakfast and then get to work. <music> chocolate and I think that's gonna be my breakfast for today um, it is almost no it is already 12 o'clock and I honestly did not think that I would wake up this late I had set an alarm to wake up earlier but I was up really late so I just ignored the alarm but um, I do have about half an hour before I have to get to class so I think I'm gonna just um, start on a little bit of homework <laughs> Last night we went to watch the Eras Tour movie and it got really late and then I came home and did homework and so far this week I just haven't been doing much homework and I have been just going out a lot because we have all of these things like tickets bought and stuff that we need to go to so it has been a crazy week it's Friday currently um, and uh, I am cleaning my room because uh, one of my friends is coming over to watch the football game tomorrow and so she's going to be spending the night here. I didn't get any writing done yesterday because I went to bed at 3 and it was just, it was too crazy. But I'm hoping that I can maybe get some done today, but it doesn't seem very likely. But I'm going to see if I can squeeze in even a little bit of writing because I haven't done as much writing as I would have liked to this week at all. I haven't made that much progress in the novel and I do genuinely want to finish it by the end of this month. There is so much that I need to do that I like, I'm like standing here basically glitching because I don't know where to go, like what to start with. I'm really stressed out. Hi, it has been several days since I last recorded or started to record this vlog. I don't know what time at what point it got lost, but this week, last week was really really hectic there was a lot going on and then I just forgot to 
keep recording but then it was okay because I didn't write anything since Wednesday and today it's Monday so um, this is me finally sitting down to write again and finally having the time to sit down and write again. And I think the reason I procrastinated this so much is because I'm not happy with the scene and I just don't want to write it but I just need to like push through it and then I'll be able to finish uh, or at least move on to the next stuff. But my goal is still to finish writing this book in November. We're getting close to wrapping up back to so the prospect of finishing so the prospect of finishing this in November is actually pretty realistic considering today is November 6th. There are still parts of, of writing this draft that I'm excited to do. Um, I just haven't got, haven't been at one of those parts lately. So we're at 186 pages, 1.5 spacing. I just, I just want it to be done at this point. It is 7.30. It looks like it's 10 p.m. outside, which I absolutely hate. Yeah, I'm just gonna write as much as I can. <laughs> just finished writing for tonight. I actually wrote quite a bit and ended up finishing the um, scene that I was so, that I had been procrastinating for so long, but I ended up writing a total of 1600 words in 40 minutes. I think that's a record honestly. I don't think that I've written that many words that quickly before but I think that's what happens when I haven't written in a really long time and I just like suddenly have the words just tumbling out of me which is such a great feeling honestly to like be able to reconnect and um, just be able to write again generally is a great feeling. So the scene's finally finally done. Um, I can move on to the next scenes. Um, this one ended in a way that I don't like and also didn't expect or plan, which is how most of the things I write end up. But genuinely, I'm not happy with this. Um, but you know what? It's fine. It's the first draft. It just has to exist. It will make sense later. The next couple scenes are pretty easy and I should be able to write them pretty quickly because they're not that long. Definitely not as long as this. And then I think we're really just going to get back in, like, just start up the climax. And once act th we hit act three, it's gonna go by so fast because there are so many scenes in act three that, I am, that I've been looking forward to writing ever since I planned this book. So I think that writing act three will be probably the easiest act out of all of these because one, it's very emotional and I love writing emotional things. Um, and it's depressing as hell. And again, I love writing depressing things. So act three should actually be really fun to write um, in terms of just being able to feel the words and, and, and the characters um, as I'm writing it and just really get immersed and lost in the story. So really looking forward to act three. Currently the manuscript is at 93,000 words, um, 93,007 words. That is really a lot of words. Um, I definitely have, uh, I will probably finish act two around 100,000 words, if not a little bit more. This is gonna be over 100,000 words, which I'm perfectly happy with because there's a lot of stuff that's, that's gonna get cut and there's a lot of stuff that I'm gonna add on later in the second draft. So I am perfectly happy with the way that this is turning out. So at least I finished the scene. But anyway, since I, did not do much writing in this vlog so far, I don't think. I think I'm gonna keep this one going. I don't know how long this is gonna end up being, but I'm gonna keep it going until I um, have my writer's workshop on Wednesday, which is two days from now. And if you've been watching the other videos, you know that I've, I have a writing fiction class that I'm taking. And for that class, I had to write a short story which is being workshopped this Wednesday. So I'm really excited and also equally terrified about Wednesday. I think I'm gonna call it a night tonight, but I will see you guys either tomorrow or 
Wednesday. I think when you open up the Word doc after the day before and you see like a glimpse of what you wrote and it was a scene that ended up actually turning out pretty great. Um, the scene that I was working on yesterday, the one that I was like super, I didn't like that much and I'm like glancing at it now and it's really not that bad. So I honestly, every time I do this to myself for no reason. It is the next day or the next night I should say and I am freaking out just a little bit because tomorrow is the workshop for my story. As of right now, it is eight o'clock and I have just finished all my work. I have also edited the vlog that I was working on yesterday a little bit more. I think I should be able to finish it tomorrow. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna start writing. I'm gonna call it a night around nine-ish. Wish me luck. <laughs> I've been writing for about an hour and a half and I just finished the writing session by writing 1300 words. I think that that's pretty good. I'm leaving it in the middle of kind of the scene so I know where to pick up from next time but really after the scene I don't know where it's going so I'm gonna have to figure that out but again it is just act to end stuff that is gonna be a problem for later i ended up writing an extra scene that i didn't actually plan for but just felt right to add 1300 words i'm pretty happy with that i'm gonna finish try to finish the rest of this tomorrow night somehow it's 9 30 and i'm sleepy i'm turning into an old lady but that's fine I, I think retirement is gonna be perfect for me because all they do is like stay at home and, and get to do whatever they want. And that literally sounds perfect for me. Hi, it is the next day. I had my workshop today and I haven't actually gotten any actual writing done today and I might get that done later tonight but I just want to talk about my workshop because it was incredible and life-changing and um, I had such an incredible time it was like 55 minutes of just talking about my story and everything good with it everything that could be improved um, my strengths as a writer my weaknesses as a writer and everybody was so so nice and kind and then um i get this huge like stack of letters and marginalia from everyone in my class and i get to go through that and i kind of already did go through most of it like literally that was like the first thing i did was go through all of that and like i'm just so excited and um because it was set in the world that my novels are going to be set in um, over and over I kept hearing people say that the world building was done really really well and I'm like good because that is like the main thing that is what I need people to like because eventually this short story won't exist in the in the actual novels but the world will and so I needed people to like the world and they did a lot and um i was just so flattered the entire time just blown away by how much everyone enjoyed it because for the longest time i did not and i'm really excited um to write Ugh, i'm just they get they got me so excited and pumped up this is 
exactly where I want to be right now. This is exactly what I want to be doing. And it just felt perfect. It was really, really great. And, and I'm just so glad everybody loved the story so much. Um, and I got a lot of great feedback about what I can improve. And those are things that I actually kind of already knew I needed to improve. So that's good that we're on the same page. That was the first time real people have read the world that I've been writing for the last year. So that gives me hope and that it just makes me more excited to write more about this world. Overall, had a great time today. It was like the best day ever. I just wanted to end this vlog off here now because it has been going on for I don't even know how many days now and it's very, very chaotic and I apologize. I It has been a chaotic week so I think the vlog accurately reflects that. So, But I am super glad that I've had so much um, happen this week. All good things, all really exciting things, especially this workshop. I'm really excited about that. But I'm also really excited about wrapping up this novel. I know it's NaNoWriMo technically, but I don't think I'll be doing it this year because I don't have 50,000 words left in this novel um, or in me. In fact, I'm like burning out a little bit. So um, but yeah, as always, thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.